All right, hello everybody. Travis Chandler here with another Fable Anniversary video. I'm gonna be doing some more questing today. One thing I need to tell y'all, um, I got some new equipment. I'll show you what I got when we get into the game. Um, got some decent equipment actually. All right, so we got the plate armor set, or I did anyway. I got the plate armor set, and I got Scorn's bow. <laughs> Hell yeah, Scorn's bow, and look at all the money I have too, 135000 Hell yeah, but Scorn's bow, it has the lightning augmentation and the um, sharpening augmentation. So it will do some damage. Trust me, it will do tons of damage. So we're going to hit the experience portal first. See what I can do, which we don't have enough to max you yet. But we do have enough to max you, so we'll go ahead and max you. And for you, we are max. So we just need to max toughness and we'll have max stats. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. So we're going to find the bandit series. In the last video, uh, Maze told us he left a quiz card with us wanting to find. Um, We'll kill at least 24 bandits. There we go. And I do want to check, do I have stock? Um, I do have stock, okay. Okay, so we're gonna just walk to Oakvale because I want the experience so I can max out toughness because I want to do that before um, moving on. I mean, I know we're moving on in the game now, but um, before we go to a, a new area. Uh -huh. Boom. Oh. So, all right. What is all this? Go. No. But with Scorm's bow, how you get Scorm's bow is you have to give um you have to give um sacrifices to the chapel of Scorm. And if you do that, it does cost uh, morality. But the bow is really worth it because it does a ton of damage. I know what you say, oh, well, why aren't you using it now? Well, it's because these weaker enemies I can just kill with one shot with my sword. So there's no need to. But when we get to tougher enemies, well, I'll see about using it, so. All right. Ah, that was loud. There we go. Oh no, 
he didn't die yet. There he died. All right. That's how you kill these things. You want to kill them with shooting the, or hitting the rocks back at them. I should have probably used inflame on that, but that's okay. That's the way to do it, master. Keep your eyes There we go. See, with this setup with the physical shield, you better have a lot of will potions because you're going to need them. You're going to need them big time. fix my camera. I didn't have it set right. God, I'm having trouble with this one. Darkwood, we go. Killing some bandits, it looks like. Move. So I can save your ass. Ooh. You hit me with a sword. You're dead, too. Now, let's test this bow out and see if we can... Boom! 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 See, look at that. Look at all that that I just... That I just did. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, 
There we go. Just to keep my um field up. But now we're gonna open a demon door. I block the way to all but the most combat hardened. If you request, my guardians will test your metal in combat. Meet their challenge, and the reward I hide is yours. I see you are ready for your test. This does not scare me now. Guardians, attack! How you do that you get get around the big ones get around the big ones and get them from behind you defeated my guardians i am knackered go on get yourself through that's how you do that i'm way overpowered for this <laughs> that's the secret to this game being overpowered you know you want to build yourself in the beginning. That way then, when it comes to these later quests, you're ready for them, you know? You can't just go, go, go in this game. You have got to take time. You have got to take time to um, build your character. You know what I'm saying? Because if you don't build your character, you're not going to have skills. Oh, crap. Oh, save your ass. There we go. I forgot the enemies respawn. There we go. Such How you do that. And hell, I could just run through these if I wanted to. <laughs> All right. Run down here to fight some hobs and some bandits. There we go. Really not gonna let me. Step over a tree root. All right. Yeah. Oh. Ah, oh, crap. See, those fuckers get in my way. I didn't mean to kill him. He just got in my way. That's the only thing that sucks about this game. Is sometimes you will not lock on to the target you want. It makes me so mad sometimes. Do a special offer for you, sir. What do we got here? Nothing. Green apples we can sell. The apple pies we can sell. The fish we can sell. That's it. There are more bandits around these days. 
and we'll stop off at the armor guy if we can find him. This is it. We'll sell some stuff. Which that's not going to sell. Nope. Alright. So in the last video you saw me give a um give a sacrifice to the chapel of scorn. You just keep doing that until the guy gets satisfied and he'll just give you Scorm's bow. He also gives you a title called and you get called Necromancer. Which I didn't like that title for me, so I changed it. You can change it at the guild. All right. See, I took him down in three, three shots with my bow. Look at that. That's the way you do it, master. Look at that. I took him out in three shots with my bow. Boom. Even though I don't really need skill points right now. Oh, oh he turned on me. That's okay. There we go. Got him. See, I mean, look how high I'm getting the combat multiplier. It's 20. I get the combat multipliers to 20. how you do that. <laughs> trying to get around him is what I was trying to do. Like I said, every time you go to a store, make sure you buy potions. Make sure you buy them because you're going to need them. Took down that Balverine in four shots. Look at that. <laughs> All right. Cool. Now we're in Borrow Fields. Okay, the hearts on the mini map, um, those are people who love me. <laughs> but we're not going to deal with them right now. We might later, but I'm not going to now, so. Brent, we're not ready to collect yet. I mean, I know we could, but, um, we're not gonna, so. 
And we're not gonna worry about selling anything right now because really they can wait. So we're gonna go straight to Twin Blades Camp. That's where we're going. But we do want to talk to her because she only shows up at night. Stand out here and look out to see. My dear husband was lost to the waters years ago. He went on a fishing expedition and never came back. Expedition. I haven't given up hope of seeing him again one day. Okay. Now we go to the cliff top path. You'll need to sneak past those bandits to reach their camp. Oh, we're not going to sneak by them. Oops. I didn't mean to hit Y. I thought that was the end of it, but no. Um, pretty much what the guildmaster tells you. If you get caught, they'll close the gate. Boom. But this is why I wanted Scorm's bow. Hope. Boom. See, that's why. Usually I can get through this without getting caught. But now you gotta hide over here. Until they reopen the gate. Okay. Now we're going to wait. Let them get in position. Boom. That's what I was trying to do. Kill the guards before they saw me. Where's the other one? There he is. He got him. Perfect. That's what I was trying to do. There, now we're in. Here, you heard what happened to Stern? No. What did the idiot do this time? He only lost his bloody cap in a raid. Uh, it was a week before he could get back into the camp. Yeah, you can't get in unless you're in full gear these days. If you ask me, old twin blades getting a bit jumpy. Don't know what's got into him. Hey, who's that? And I love how he looks behind him. Come on, little bastard. There we go. We'll come over here and boom.
We'll come over here and boom. That's how you do that. Then you want to open all these chests to get your bandit gear. There we go. You have reached legendary status. Am I getting evil deeds for killing the bandits? I shouldn't. No, I'm getting good deeds. about to say it's like what why am i getting evil deeds for it no i'm not i'm getting good deeds for it huh all right whatever There. 24 bandits were at least slaughtered, but we're going to slaughter them all just so we can get our revenge. There we go. Four. We'll get you just so we have all five. Okay. I stabbed him. That was funny. There we go. Kill our bandit buddies. There we go. Resurrection file. We don't really need it, but that's okay. You're not one of them, are you? My eyesight's not what it used to be. One was a gallant knight. His plate armor was so shiny. Probably what did my eyes in. Then there was an evil mage. Wore the darkest magical robes you ever saw. The last was a rogue. A bandit, bit like the chaps here. Where is the gallant knight I await? Okay. I thought this was that door. I've got the will stuff. There we go. Now... Need to get into the bandit gear. You want in? You better talk to me. 
Hello, mate. Nice bandit gear. This here is Twin Blades Camp. Once you're in, you're in for good. So, feel free to get changed when you're inside. Another one coming in, Joe. Open the gates. Okay, now that we're in, now we can go back to our plate mail. Okay. Now, I, if I remember right, you gotta talk to this guy first. You gotta have a pass to get that. You're not going anywhere where a bandit's residence pass. There's a bloke in the tavern's got one. Practically lives there. All right. Chicken chase. I'm pleased to serve you. You only sell dark stuff? Yep, you only sell dark stuff. Okay. You don't want to buy anything. I'm pleased to serve you. Okay. There is nothing we need here. Well, well, fuck it. Just to get rid of them. There. Oh. You don't want any of that either. Okay, we'll buy our potions. Buy the jets. You buy you, but you're too expensive. Buy you, buy you. something okay so now we need to go to the tavern I've uh, heard you might be interested in procuring a camp pass well I can get you one but it'll cost you a thousand gold excellent choice my friend excellent choice there we go I bought me a pass Isn't there a fishing spot over here? No? Flam's a bodyguard, but we don't need him. We don't mind him. If you don't have a pass, looks like a valid pass to me. And you go. Let him through! In the Twin Blades Elite Camp we go. Okay, there are some good deeds here. Ages of Might Potion, nice. Oh, you can steal that. That's cool. I didn't know that. Stop. We wreck other people's stuff, not our own. Alright.
Ciao, lady. Come to look at Twin Blades Entertainment. Ain't they just lovely? <laughs> Gonna be a fun party, all right. Help! Let us out of here! Who has the key? I think it's you, isn't it? Yep, you have it. I thought so. The guard has the key. Get it. Thank you so much. I thought we were going to die, but we have to leave quickly before the guards notice. Twin Blades hostages have escaped! Grab them before they get away! That's how you get into the camp. Well done. The gate is open. You can go to Twin Blades area now. Wind blades ten, ten it is. All right. I've been waiting for you. Stand back, lads. Twin blade wants a word with this little hero. See what you're made of. That's the key. You want to get Twin Blades back. He's slow. There we go. Finish it quick then. I'd do the same for you. There you are. What's wrong? Don't you recognize your own sister? Her past once again before her. Teresa's memories returned in a blaze of fire. Oak Vale was burning. She watched in silence as the bandits tortured her mother, then turned to her with questions of the missing boy. She answered them only with a stare, and so their leader sliced out her eyes. The raiders took the boy's mother and left Teresa alone in the forest. There she crawled for three days, blind and desolate, until she was found by bandits, Twin Blade and his men. She began a new life of servitude among their clan. But the bandit king sensed her exceptional strength and power of will and listened as she whispered dark prophetic truths in her sleep. Those who could never accept this small blind girl standing by their master's side did not last long. 
When they attacked, she killed them without mercy and without emotion. For this was her place in the world now. I've seen so many things. So much killing. So much dying. I've seen you, little brother. In a ring of sand and blood. An arena full of secrets. And I've seen the choice you'll have to make one day. Between the darkness and the light. Teresa! I'm sorry, Twinblade. Your path is alone now. All our paths are. But before I leave, brother, I have a present for you. For all the birthdays I've missed. A power that runs in our family. He finds you when you're sleeping, and when the daylight fades. What are you waiting for? Finish it, or leave me alone. I'm dead anyway. I'm no one's king anymore. You can kill Twinblade if you want, but I'm not gonna do it. Because for some reason you get um, more renown if you leave him alive. That, and if you kill Twinblade, you have to fight all his minions too, so... <gasps> so, I don't know, I've never killed Twinblade though. Wait, there's a path up there I've never gone up to either. What's over here? A diamond? Okay. Find diamonds! Find diamonds! <laughs> yeah, for some reason you get an ass load of um, renown for leaving Twinblade alive. Right, I thought it was renown. I guess it's not. I guess it's only uh, good deeds. Okay. That was a very impressive victory, Hero. But Maze has more news for you at the Guild. I suggest you return here at once. Okay. Another resurrection. New resurrection file. Check the Guild for more quests. Windblade camp. Chicken chaser. Well, you think we can do a special do offer chickens? for you, sir? Yeah, that's they're cheap. We need stock. Okay. You want to see Maze in the guild? Okay, so we're gonna go to town. I'm gonna go to Bowerstone. Because I need to check on the rent there. I thought the rent was ready. Enjoy yourself. Wow! He's more amazing than I am. Okay. 
we're gonna turn in some books too now that I'm thinking about it as soon as the school opens which we'll go to the tavern and sleep for the night Okay. Lovely. Go. Thunder. Well, well. Look who it is. Come to play with the other children, have you? Shame Whisper has such a soft spot for you. She should have taught you a lesson in Orchard Farm. But she'll learn. I only hope you both end up in the arena one day. Then we'll see who the greater hero is. But I've wasted enough time talking. The Guildmaster needs me back at the Guild. He can't entrust important quests to novices like you. Okay. Where's the teacher? Chicken chaser me. Where's the teacher? Is he coming? I think he's coming. Okay. He's so unbelievable. It's untrue. Yep, there he is. There he is, Mr. Gout. Ooh, do you have a donation there, hero? Sure do. A little macabre, perhaps, but uh, the tale of Maxley could teach some of our pupils a valuable lesson. Why don't you stay and listen, hero? It's never too late to learn. There once lived a hob, and Maxley was his name. He was that rarest of hobs, one with a brain. Making his bed in a stream wasn't for him. He'd rather live in a village, there among men. One day he decided to travel to town. He slew a great noble and put on his gown. In Bowerstone by all was he complimented, and though short of stature, he stood proud and erected. Hmm, me. But Maxley forgot what he was and grunted hello. And when the men heard his voice, all they did know. They called out for guards who lopped off his head. It stuck on a spike. Dumb and ugly and dead. So when you're about to open your mouth, remember Maxley the Hob. For it's better to be thought an idiot than to be killed by a mob. Yay! Yay! Right stuff! Right. Wow. He's more amazing than I imagined. I'm going to be a hero like you. Do you have a donation there, hero? Sure do. What was this? The sock method? Uh, uh, yes, yeah, so, well, uh, perhaps when they're uh, a little older, don't you think? Uh, I suppose it can't do any harm. Ah, let's turn to the sock method and see how we can... Make you sexier in ten days. Uh. Yay! This hero seems to have truly mastered the book's teachings. Maybe he could show us what he's learned from it. Come on. Uh. Oh, my. <laughs> and that brings today's lesson to a close. <laughs> Definitely. That's funny. That's funny. 
have we found any interesting Woo reading material? Oh, Come my. On. The Windbreaker Rule Book. Avo alone knows what would happen if the children got hold of this. All right, then. I'll give it a try. Today, we will be reading from the Windbreaker <laughs> Rule Book. Perhaps the gentleman who gave us this book could demonstrate the uh, benefits of its teachings himself. <laughs> yes. I see. Well, <laughs> most edifying. But I really don't. Yay! Oh, dear Lord. Something must have crawled up inside him and died. Shit! <laughs> Please, mind your language in front of <laughs> I forgot about this one. This was a mistake. I forgot about this one. Any books for us today, hero? Who's that you have there? The ugly guide? I'm <laughs> sure you'll agree. This snotty lot needs no help in that area. Don't tell their parents I said that. All right, then. I'll give it a try. Today's lesson is from the Ugly Guide. Though clearly, this hero has never practiced its teachings. Now, what do you think makes a person look ugly? Having stupid hair. That's right. Certain haircuts can make a person less attractive as can some forms of facial hair, especially on a woman. Any other ideas? Eating too much. Very good. That's why everybody in Albion has such a perfect waistline, from the greatest hero to the lowliest beggar. Except for Jenna from Orchard Farm, of course. She used to be but a slip of a girl, but now... <laughs> That woman certainly likes her cider. Uh, anyway, uh, that concludes our lesson for today. Oh, you can stop you. You're the best, Jason. Any books for us today, hero? I suppose you are not a bad person might come in useful one day. I really hope the children won't need its advice, though. Well... If you think that's wise, hero... Damn right I do. Today, we will be looking at You Are Not a Bad Person. It would seem this hero has decided he has no need of the book. But perhaps one of you can tell me how you can make yourself less scary. Wear a pretty dress. That's right. A person's clothes say a lot about them. And wandering around town dressed in dark leather or chainmail can frighten people. Any other ideas? Don't wear anything at all. Ah. Well, uh, that might make you look more silly than scary. I'm not too sure men running around naked inspire much confidence. Perhaps we should see what the book has to say on this matter. Got some books for me, heroes? Why don't you bring them round during school hours? Come on! Okay, school's over. Go for it! Come on! Alright. Oh. Damn, I sent that chicken flying. <laughs> oh, now closing. No, no. That's okay. We'll rest at the tavern again, and then we'll see about selling things. So you're the challenger. Look at our swordsman. No, I don't need no swordsman. I got my bow, so no, I don't. Hooray! Hello. Hooray! 
always great to see you. All right, get out of my way. Out of my way. Oh, Silly. It was nighttime when I slept. Come on, get out of the way. Really? Play card pairs. Here, chuck us over a beer, would you? Yes. Get out of the way! Get out of the way! That's what annoys me of this bullshit. They stop right where they're at to appreciate you, which is cool, but at the same fucking time, it's like you're trying to get up these stairs and you can't. Look at our assortment. I want the beer. Jesus. Have a good day. And we see that's a glitch. I'm pleased to serve you. Just get rid of them. There, get rid of the leg and get rid of the leather shit. Ah, uh, yes. Maze is in his quarters at the guild. He'd like to see you there. Yep, he's glitched. That happens sometimes. I, I don't really know why. But you have to refresh the screen. To get him to put his stuff down. And I don't really understand why. It's the same with the rent. To get the rent to spawn, you have to re refresh the screen. Profit of nine, we'll take. Profit of 21, we'll take. But we'll take, we're not taking a loss, I'll tell you that right now. But the beer kegs we can sell at the tavern. Oh, you want a beer, please? There he is. Lovely. Ooh, Ready to see. help? Yes. But still at a loss. I ain't buying at that, no way. Nope. Definitely not. All right. You glitched again. I don't understand why you're glitching bad now. And sometimes that happens with this game. I, I don't know why. I don't know why, but with this game, Sometimes it happens. You have to leave town and come back in to get him to work again. There. Bye. Bye. Those are really cheap. We'll buy them. Buy the stock. Okay. And I want to know. He won't take any of the. Okay. He won't take any of the gems. So we'll go to the guild now. We'll talk to Maze. And then we'll call it for this video.
appointed, sir. You can come here to the hero title vendor, and you can change your title if you want. I'm pleased to serve you. Some of them you can't buy from him. Ah, uh, yes. Some of them you have to earn from other uh, avenues, like Necromancer. You have to um, get Scorn's bow to get it. But I didn't want to be called Necromancer, so. So we go to Maze's quarters over here. And up the stairs we go. So, you really found your sister? <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena, out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favor, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing. Calls himself the archaeologist. He may have stumbled onto something big. Perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumor that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. That is, if he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis Gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late. You've received a new quest card. All right. So we're going to go downstairs. We're going to look at my... Um... Look at my experience. And then I'll just call it for this video. So... I want to see if I can max out toughness. I really don't want to go to Witchwood yet. Without getting max toughness. And you'll see why once I do it. Which we can. Buy it. Hell yeah. Beat. We are fully maxed out on stats. Now we can just concentrate on our will. Um. We'll go heal life three. All right. I found my perfect hero. <laughs> cool. So we'll go back in the guild so I can have it save and then I'll call it for this video. So I hope y'all had fun in this video. I actually did. I had a ton of fun. Yes. So I will see y'all in the next video.